Hi friends, it's me, Simply Sherry, and thank you for joining me again for another Costco haul. This one is two months worth of Costco, so for January and February, I have a budget of $150 per month. This came out to $325, so I'll have to take off $25 either somewhere in my budget or for the Costco budget in March. So let's start over here with the lemons. My husband loves lemons, so he uses it all the time. So I got two bags, hopefully enough to last for the month. And then we have here some mangoes, power greens, and the baby spinach. So nothing new here uh, as far as what Costco offers. And then there are dates. And then for part of my prepping, I am going to prep some of this garlic because I don't think, pretty sure we're not gonna get through this in the next two months, three months, or maybe even four months. So I'm gonna prep that. And then I have here mushrooms. I'm thinking of also prepping this by uh, doing some um, freeze drying. And bread, we go through this probably either in 10 days or 14 days, so I'll most likely buy some more with my regular grocery budget. And we, or I had stocked up on um, ketchup, and this is the one that they have now. I have it backwards here. So it's the Hunt's 100% Natural. And uh, we've gone through, I think three bottles already. So I have three bottles left. Three bottles in like a month. So I think I'll have to get more of those for my next stock up haul. Got some Parmesan cheese because we're out of that, out of Cholula, and then out of Tabasco. So this is more of just for our regular groceries as far as uh, what we're going to eat, not prepping. And then I saw these, and I think we've tried these before, so wanted to have those on hand. We love the chocolate cake. My husband loves this chocolate cake. And we usually eat, I usually buy him a slice of chocolate cake at the specialty shop here every week. So I thought, let me just get him this for this week and next week. And then this uh, pasta is for prepping for my prepper pantry. So, you know, the spaghetti and the different types of pasta, like the, I think this is penne. And then this is the gemelli and casarace. Okay, not very good. I'm actually trying to learn some Italian. I bit the bullet and uh, bought the Babbel once a month, uh, a monthly fee, trying to learn Italian. That was obviously horrible Italian. But anyway, uh, here got the meatloaf. We love this. So I did get a few things because it's been so busy uh, in the month of January for my regular work. And I've just been cooking like twice a week. I usually cook four times a week. And it's just been so crazy. So I thought, let me get a few more things that are already prepared. And so I won't feel so bad all the time. So I tried to do four times. It went down to three to two. So kind of feeling bad about that. But I'm going to try to pick that back up again once my work has uh, kind of stabilized a little bit. And then here we have some stuffed peppers. We love this also. And then this is something I've, I've seen it the last time I was there a couple months ago. But I thought I'd try it this time. So they are chicken street tacos. And this is my favorite. Totally going to eat this. I eat this within a whole week. This is all for me. And uh, it's the Dungeness crab. And I usually just eat this with rice. And my sauce is, or my dipping sauce, is actually vinegar, garlic, and some ground pepper. I don't know if that's a very Filipino thing, but I think it's a very Filipino thing. Okay, over here, this is something I saw. I thought we'd try this also. Um, I try to get some frozen foods for my daughter for her lunch. It's just easier for her to, she's online right now, um, school online. So she just comes downstairs, uh, prepares her lunch. I'm also upstairs doing my work. So this is just a lot easier to get stuff like this. And then I love the chicken pot pies and then definitely bacon. So this usually lasts for the month or maybe a month and a half. We cook like bacon maybe twice a month or um, every three weeks or something like that. So this usually lasts a month. And then I am making lasagna next week. So I thought for some of the ground beef, I'll use, I'll use some of this ground beef for the lasagna and I will just freeze the rest. And then over here, definitely have to have snacks. So we have Doritos. That is actually usually for me also. I know I look like a piggy, but um, instead of buying the small bags 
at the regular grocery store, this is definitely a much better price. And then we have the sea salt here. There are a lot of chips out this week and I think a few new ones. Um, but I was uh, looking for this certain one and I didn't see it. So I went ahead and got this one that we're familiar with. And then this one I've seen out before, but I thought we'd try it now. And these are shrimp chips and we love these. We love shrimp chips from the Asian store. So I thought, let's go ahead and try this. Um, and uh, I'm hoping it's good. Okay, then definitely stocking up on the Kirkland sparkling water. My family likes this versus even LaCroix and uh, Bubbly and Izzy. Izzy's a little bit um, sugary for us, but we really like this and it's a good price. And I noticed that they've increased their price for this. So we got two of them. They're 35 in each pack. My beverage cooler uh, fits 80 cans, so we're good with that. And then I had to get some more almond milk. I was hoping not to have to buy one, um, uh, a box of these until next month because that's kind of what I had planned for. But we have eight of these left and not sure it's gonna last for the whole month. So probably just for the next two, maybe three weeks. So I wanted to get one just since I was at Costco already and I try not to go more than once a month. I just wanted to make sure we had that. So all together, this cost $325. So I used my $150 budget for January and also for February. Gotta take out that 25 bucks somewhere or place it somewhere else and uh, or take it out from the the March budget as I said so I hope you enjoyed this Costco haul is there anything here that is a go-to for you and also what do you think about um, these prepared meals is that something you um, get every so often is that a regular thing that you do love to know and uh, I will see you in the next video bye